Hello, I'm Chris Menard. Microsoft Teams has a great new feature. This rolled out on January 8th, 2021. Inside of your Teams and inside of Channels, you can now have Channel Calendars. So let's take a look. Three things I'm going to cover. How to create a Channel Calendar. How to send invites out to the Channel Meeting. And then a main tip, a really important tip, when you send out this, how to accept it. So let's go ahead and get started with number one. This is going to be how to add a channel calendar. I'm in HR. I'm on the recruitment channel. By default, there's always three tabs at the top. Post, Files, Wiki. Add a new tab is the plus sign. Click it once. I've been playing in here, so it's the first one for me, but if you don't see channel calendar type in the word channel there it is click it one time if you get a box that says add you'll need to add this once but once you've added it then you can start putting channel calendars on your channels it always wants to name it channel calendar i don't think that's a good name i'm gonna name it the name of the channel recruitment calendar Post to this channel about this tab. I recommend you leave that check. I'll show you what that does right now when I hit add. I should have four tabs up at the top, and I do. I have a recruitment calendar. You can always come over here and change the spelling, that change the names, rename it, remove it. I have nothing coming up this week, but I do have it here. That box that said post to this channel, when I go to post, I'm letting everyone that follows the recruitment channel know, hey, there's a recruitment calendar now. When you click it, watch, you jump there. So that is how you add a channel calendar. Now let's discuss how to send out an invite, a meeting invite to that calendar. Two ways, method one has always been here. Go to your calendar in Teams. This will not work in Outlook. Uh, I'm going to keep this simple. I'm going to go to the 18th at noon. I'm going to call it test one to keep it easy. Major point, there are no required attendees here for this, but it says add channel. There are my channels. HR recruitment. So test one, HR recruitment at noon today. Send. It's on my calendar since I'm the organizer. I scheduled that. If I go to Teams, Recruitment, Recruitment Calendar, there it is. So this is a cool way to find out if any channels are having meetings. That invite I just sent out also shows up under Post for Recruitment. But can you imagine if this is the only place you have to look to see if there are meetings? That's why this channel calendar is such a cool feature. I would have to keep scrolling up and down and looking. I went to my calendar for method one to send out the invite. Method two is just to do it from this calendar. I'm going to do one at 2 p.m. It puts it in here for you since you're on the calendar. This is going to be test two. And there it is. People that are members of the Human Resources team, because that's the name of the team, are not getting invites. I want to be real clear about that, which leads me to this point. If you want to make sure that someone that's in Human Resources team is coming to this meeting, make sure you put them on the required attendees line. Then they will get an Outlook invite and they can say, I'm going to accept, decline, tentative. So you do have to put people here if you want them to get an actual invitation. We'll close that and not send it. Which leads me to point another point. What happens if you see something on this calendar and you know you didn't get an Outlook invite, but you want to make sure it's on your main calendar? So let me show you that one. So Carol, I'll show you this. I'm in here as Carol Wilson. So Carol is now scheduling a meeting for today at 9 p.m. to 11 p.m. HR recruitment, 
send. So that went on to Carol's calendar. She's the organizer. Oh, there it is. It went on the recruitment calendar. It also shows up in our post. So here's my point. If I want to make sure I get notified about that meeting and put it on my calendar, I'm going to come over here to this meeting. Three dots for more options. My bad. Three dots. View meeting details. And I need to add that to my calendar. So let's make sure that this shows up on my calendar. Before I do, let's see if it's there now. Calendar. That meeting is on the 18th at 11 o'clock. I don't see it. Back to Teams, same place, three dots. Add to calendar, accepted. It should be here now. Let's go see calendar. Bam, there it is. So I hope that helps. That is actually a great feature, having this channel calendar. I just showed you how to send out an invite. I ho showed you how to accept an invite. And we discussed the important point about invites really don't go out to people's outlook for them to accept unless you add them to the required attendees line. Thank you for your time. Let me know if you have any comments or questions about this really new cool feature. Feel free to subscribe. Have a great day. Thank you.